they were rock climbing, he got to the top of the wall and he fell. A family is suing over Gatlinburg for negligence after a child fell from its rock wall and suffered a severe head injury. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about a story that happened in August of 2022. It, a death wasn't the result like a lot of my other stories are, but this is a big injury that happened at an attraction in the Great Smoky Mountains. When you go to the Smoky Mountains, there's so many things to do for families. There's um, like calm things, you know, like if you just want to like chill out, you know, golf, things like that. But then there's like more daring stuff. There's um, like these mountain top attractions. There's like these roller coasters on the side of the mountain. There's all kinds of other crazy stuff. So what happened at Ober of Gatlinburg, there was a, a boy and his family and they were rock climbing. They, you know, it's, it was like any other day, any other vacation. They were rock climbing. He got to the top of the wall and he fell. The lawsuit says a nine-year-old boy was visiting Ober with his mother and baseball team from Florida. The suit claims employees failed to harness the child or attach him to the rope belay system. The boy ended up falling and landing on concrete surrounding that wall. The suit says he suffered a skull fracture plus serious and permanent injuries. The family is asking for $1 million in damages. They don't really know what happened. But as a result from this, he has a traumatic brain injury and it's like extremely, it's, it's extremely bad. They have found that the employees were at fault because they didn't even like strap him in. They didn't even properly secure him or anything like that. And I just can't imagine just a day with your family going to this and, and that happening. At Ober of Gatlinburg, this is another mountaintop attraction. You have to go in like these trolley type of things to get up the mountain. We went and we, um, we got invited to go by them. And it actually, uh, I, I, don't, I don't know what happened exactly, but like the trolley stopped for literally like an hour or an hour and a half. And it was so hot. We were like 200 feet up. It was so, it was so crazy. And I'm like, this is such a bad impression the first time that we come here. Hello everybody, before you get off the tram, and I know you're probably itching to get off of it, we want to say we're truthfully sorry about this. Lightning happened, and it's an unfortunate event. Now, we, I have a lady right over here who's going to... You're going to follow her, and we're going to issue you all a refund for your tram ride. And I have waters here for you. Does anybody here need medical attention? No. Nobody here needs medical attention? All right. Well, right here, we're going to pass you some waters, OK? Again, I don't apologize. But they have like skiing, they have bumper cars, they have um, like, it's kind of like a fair type of rides there. So there's really everything for anybody there. And over Gatlinburg, it, it was really fun we went. I like the whole vibes there because it kind of reminds you, it's kind of like older and they haven't done like, you know, real modern, it's not real modern inside. So it reminded me of kind of like, you know, like nostalgia type of like, childhood things and they have like arcade games and they have a, like a food court type of thing so it was it was really fun when, when we went so the family is suing Ober Gatlinburg for a million dollars it's it's crazy it's such a big lawsuit going on right now they're suing them for like disfigurement for medical expenses legal expenses just all kinds of all kinds of everything that he he's been going through and having to deal with the lawsuit also uh, faulted Ober because they said that they had not, no protective padding at the bottom for somebody did fall. So he literally hit like concrete on the, you know, the ground whenever he, whenever he fell. I didn't hear about this. I've heard about a lot of other things that happened in Pigeon Forge just by, you know, Googling because you literally don't hear about it. Um, it's a big tourist town. 
uh, we just didn't hear about it. And I think that's kind of sad because, you know, a lot of people go to these places and do things like this, but to not know about that and the fact that they were just up and operating like normal the next day, it's, it's kind of crazy. I would never do rock climbing personally just because like I've heard horror stories and this is another reason because this is another horror story that I've heard. So I, I don't think I would ever do it. The lawsuit is still going on and it's a tragedy because his life has totally changed. You know, living with a brain injury, it's, it totally changes like thought patterns and just, just how you live day to day life. And I hope he fully recovers and lives his best life. I'll pray for the family, be, you know, thinking of them and just send them good vibes. So if you have any suggestions on any videos, just comment down below and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.